Hello, everybody. Hope you're having a no-blessed day. Today's video, we're back in game of Red Dead Redemption 2, the most beautiful god game I've ever played in my life. Yeah, again, I know episode as we play through the story of Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, doing well. something a little bit unique, you know, we're actually not doing a main story mission today. We're actually going to be doing a side mission, because look at this weird gentleman back here. You know, he is part of a carnival, and I remember this being a very I'm interesting sorry. quest. So if I did, no one no, would just make you an episode about this. I'm quest. ruined. So sit back, relax, ruined. and enjoy the oh, tales so. of whatever the frick it's a is disaster. going on. He's British, of course. Who wants to see a woman wrangle wild animals who doesn't have any bloody wild animals? Come to America, they said. Come to the land of opportunity, they said. Sod you, Daddy, I said. I'm going to America to make it on the stage. I don't want to be in the army. Ooh. Now look at me. The old git will have a field day. I didn't really understand any of that. I had an act. The bravest woman in the world. The animal wrangler. Watch her tame wild beasts. And you were the woman. Of course I was the bloody woman. Look at me. It's the stage. Grease paint. Tears. No one wants to see a man wrangling wild animals. And no one wants to see a woman wrangling nothing. <sighs> Can I borrow your gun? I want to shoot myself. You see, I'm buggered. Why? Can I borrow your gun? I want to shoot myself. You see, I'm buggered. Why? It's my animals. They escaped. And now I'm... Sorry I'm about that. Buggered. We had a little bit of what technical escaped? problems. So you've seen a little of run back there. Well, now we're tiger. back on track. Don't from worry. the slopes of the Hindu Heights. A fantastic, elusive zebra from the plains of Ongo Bongo by the shores of the Limpopo. And a magnificent lion from the grasslands of Tanganyika. Yeah, I see your problem. They're pretty hard to come by around here. Listen, friend. Help a fellow out, would you? I'm beyond desperate. If you see any of them, will you bring them back here? If I see a tiger or a lion or a zebra just roaming around. Exactly. If, well, I believe the zebra's up near Lonard Sod. Distinctive creature that he is. I'll make it worth your while. All right, madam. It's bloody Margaret, not madam. Whatever, I don't care. All right. Margaret. So we're going to find a zebra. Line and a tiger, and the zebra is supposedly up here. Oh lord, what have we got ourselves into? Hey, you never know. Maybe this the zebra is legit. And if it's legit, you know, I, I love El Diablo, but you know, I think we're pretty bold to be riding up on a zebra. You know, so let's hope, let's see if we can find a zebra. We may try to keep yeah. it for ourselves. You never know. Even though, in case you use a little animal tag, zebras are not related to horses. They actually are related to donkeys. So yeah, there's no history back. More related to them. You can tell from the from their tails. They have kind of like the donkey tails, not of course the main tail like the one you see on the horse right now. There you go. You some kind of coward hiding your face like that? Hiding my face like that. Oh, I got one of those masks on, I think, right now. Oh, whatever. <laughs> I don't know why I have it on, but look how we're fit. I'm also kind of worried about this part not finding a zebra. We're getting to that sketchy side of the map, okay? You know what that sketchy side of the map is? That's where Cornwall's little oil field is. I just, I just tend to realize that any time I get near this place, bad things tend to happen to me. Alright, so uh, uh, here's the hoping. If in this day's time, I'm correct, you know, I just go find a zebra. I take it all back to the person. Man, we're not exactly what they are trying to do. Or be. Go on for that, okay. Let's play all of this cross through here. And should be right up this hill right here, I'm guessing. Oh, shoot, it's ran over duck. Do something. Well, hey, no crino spilt milk for that, right here. Hey, I'll take some nice feathers. You know, we can always use some flight feathers right now, okay? That'd be very good to get. Okay, I'm gonna like that. And let's see. What do we get? Some bird meat, we got some goose feathers, and yep, there's a flat feather. You know what? We'll just toss it on the horse. We may or may not uh, sell it. Uh, there has been multiple times I have forgotten about a goddamn thing on this horse, and then yep. by the time I remember, my horse has done like 560 like backflip and like lost the item. Yeah, you've seen it from that other episode. You know, I'm just trying to find through the goddamn creek, you know, and that little pebble, little pebbles, eyeing me up and down for like a mile away, saying, Oh, 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 oh we see the guy and the horse are coming. We are going to the end of life. And he basically did, you know, ran me over, basically, I tried running it over and it flipped me out, man. Oh, that 
that's the horse. That's the horse. Yeah, I caught him. Uh, donkey zebra. Okay. Come down gotcha. there. Just get on you. Oh, don't, don't you dare break that line. Calm it down. Wait for me to get to you. Right here. You quote unquote mule. Okay. So, unfortunately, boys and girls, we are not going to be rocking the mule. Because mule's not that fast. So, uh, we don't get the zebra. So sad. So sad. Alright, let's see if we can get this thing going. Uh, we, got, we got a boost of data. I gotta break my data out a little bit. Wait, corn was pretty good. And also, you know, last time I was over here, I didn't pick my tunnel horse to follow. Well, let's make sure he does that this time. <laughs> Lord, I hate running back to this location. It's okay. Let's go boost this uh, zebra up. You know, gotta get hungry. Ooh, this isn't just die on the way back. Look at that same. Look at that how far it has. That stamina. This thing can die for a quick. You know, if one of those like roll like real style rock shows up again and like, targets this donkey. You know what the fuck it is? I don't know. We're gonna be in trouble. Going to die. Alright. Oh, wow. Yeah. Get the other thing. Maybe get some guy by the bottom, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> no, I gave you a nice crispy green apple, okay? That was a very good apple. Let's have an apple that ate myself. Uh, uh, that was Mr. Mel Diablo. He loves those apples. So I'll let you have one of his. He ain't happy about that, but he ain't throwing a fit about it. He ain't coming, so I don't think he's This is this, this thing back here. This is instead what he's gonna get. Right, we got you back. Oh, yeah. Good grief! You found him! Our zebra! <laughs> well, you can call him that. <laughs> Although he's as much a zebra as you are a. Lady Animal Wrangler. Oh dear, you're missing the point, aren't you? It's an illusion, a trick of the eye to bamboozle the senses. Confound comprehension. Hoodwink your audience? Hoodwink? Our audiences? <laughs> dear boy, don't be so dreadfully literal. No one will pay for the truth. They only pay for deception. <laughs> the allure of the stage, dreams and reality. Ah. What is the greater conjuring trick? Lassoing some poor beast on the plains of Mumbo Jumbo Land and shipping it here so it can dance the polka or turning. There, in the glare of those arc lamps, something mundane into something extraordinary. It's the difference between prose and poetry. It's alchemy. We're selling dreams, dear boy. Well, as long as... As long as you don't pay me with tickets to your show. Ah, uh, yes. Well, it's not everyone's cup of tea. And speaking of my payment... Of course, of course. I shall make it worth your while. But, um, first, we shall need the whole menagerie back before we can think about that. My assistant's gone for the tiger. Tiger? Yes, yes. And taken our remaining lion in case it could lend a paw. They're down there on Caliga Way. Please, I hate to ask. All right, I'll see what I can do. Time to go, boy. Tiger. Yeah. Get a moving.
say it, it's just lagging up there. I'm guessing it's just lagging up this place. Alright. Yeah, it's an iron. Where is she? Hey, mister. Oh. Miss. Howdy, mister. Did, uh, um, you lose a tiger? Yeah, you found one? <clears throat> nah, I found your caravan down the way. Uh, Margaret said that you might need a hand. Oh, he weren't wrong. That tiger's missing. I sent our best lion out to find him, and uh, now he's missing too. It is a right old predicament. You're lying from uh, Timbuktu, weren't he? Oh, from Valentine, I think. He might be more of a kind of dog than a lion, but in a certain light, a feller could never tell. <sighs> of course. Which way'd he go? Sure. Into them shrubs over there. You know, uh, okay. Fire pound line, compare Why don't like you a, hop up on the wagon and I'll see if I can find this track. Okay. That first set of shrubs, that's where I left side of it. I got it. Alright, let's go figure out what it is. Lying in the tire the paint. Trail. Yeah. These are paw prints. Oh, right. You paint this dog? There's some pigment here. Looks like... Back blood to me. Shit, what's this? Oh, that's not good. Oh, I see a flicker up there. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I found your dog. Uh, yeah. Ex dog X line. Hey, boy. Oh, where's the rest of them? I think a cougar took him. Oh, that'd be stripey. And I always thought they got Where's along. The Your tiger is a wild cat? Uh-huh. What else? You still need it back? Oh, yes, sir. She's our star attraction. Well, let's hope it wants the other half of its dinner. Oh, are you kidding me? We're gonna, we're gonna... Oh, no. We're really? the dog. To I'm gonna put him in your wagon. That's my you find somewhere to hide. I think my oh. cat just walked into my room right now. Well, like, hey, what's up? Behind that log, then. Okay. Hey, stand, stand. Are you fair? She is bit my toe. That, that, no, no. Stay down. She won't be too far. Step off you better leave I her. went out to find a tiger. Uh, cougar. Oh, you mean? And there, I end up, up losing there. a lion. Walk. She has a problem. I have an exercise bike in my room. And she has a bad tendency yeah, to want to jump up there and claw to seek the pieces. You know, well, anyone knows me. You know, you my exercise bike is pretty important. You know. Time when there's like weight loss challenge at my hey, workplace. It ain't what you got in this life. It's what you so, uh, when this cat comes up trying to wreck well, it, you know, very well, it hurts me, but I tell Especially the tales to my teacher friends and stuff. And they get a heyday out of it for sure. They're like, oh, yeah, it's not bad. The kitty's destroy your exercise bike because, you know, I'm Look, doing pretty I good. You know, I started this back in January. January 9th, I think. It was French. At the time of this video, it's April 4th. I lost over 65 pounds. Yeah. Doing not working on that bike. Wow. Can't get that hey, go. Oh. No, we, want to, we want to break 200 for weight. She's, hungry. she's feral. I haven't been on 200 for about the last eight, nine years. So it's about time to get yourself back in good shape where we were, okay? Taking charge of our lives. You know, if you want, to, want me to post my kind of routine of how I got myself down 65 pounds in like basically two and a half, almost three months, put right. in the comment section, you know, we can share that little secret. Let's go. Now you can cry for yourself so you can work for okay. you just as well as I do. Yep. Drive, will you? And I'll keep an eye on her. Sure thing. Let's get her back yeah, to the shop. Look, Cougar thing here is just about my head off. All I got. I what I got to do is wag. Since I hate close to now. Wag. Wild creatures turn on each other. Seeming friendly one minute, tender okay. the next. This is this. Oh, God, easy. I mean, I should know. I've run with a few of them myself. Is that right? No, not really. Hey, uh, I realize I ain't properly introduced myself. Sally Nash. Arthur Morgan. Nice to meet you, sir. Tell me, Miss Nash, how you end up in this rack? I, I guess it's always been my inclination, you know? Wild beasts and the like. I met Mr. Margaret, we got to talking, and... You can probably tell, in this field, he's the ace of spades. He's a card, all right. It's my modest hope, one day, to be the world's second bravest woman animal wrangler. Well, I'd say you got that sewn up and then some. You think? I hope.
hope so. Top five, at least. It depends on how many more fellas throw their hat in the ring. Maybe one of these days, the best female for the job will actually be the female. Oh, I don't know if that'll ever happen. We lost the main road around here when the dust was up. Be careful, or you might get wrecked too. Okay. You know, the only thing to do in a dust storm is wait it out. Mr. Margaret's a lot of things, but best female navigator ain't one of them. I uh, imagine you're right about that. We was tearing around here, looking for any kind of landmark. Yeah, when over show. we go, whole yeah. caravan toppled. We found each other and some shelter, but when the wind died down, the animals was gone. Thanks to you. Oh, uh, you would have managed it yourself. I just helped you along. You ever want to get inside your business? I'm sure there'd be a place for a fellow like you. I'll leave the professional theatrics to better women than me. There it is. Aha! I see you found each other. Sure did, Mr. Margaret. Jolly good! Jolly good! You know, tarn and feathering a donkey is one thing. I beg your pardon? It's grease paint. Makeup. But playing dolls dressed up with a wild animal, you're gonna want to be a lot more careful. Strappy eight king, Mr. Margaret. I saw her do it. I always thought they got along. Oh, she liked him just fine. She licked her chops and asked for seconds. Hey, speaking of which, you got any more word on that uh, runaway lion, or are you gonna pay me for these misfits? Look, I'm well aware that we're not Royal Command performance material. Daddy, you were right, goddamn you! But a cow barn in Rhodes is hardly Drury Bloody Lane. You got any word on the lion? Yes, yes, I've got word on the lion. Shit is the word. Someone saw him near Emerald Ranch. As you know, we're lately very short on lions. So, I'd be very grateful. All right. All kinds of grateful. There's only one kind of grateful I care about. So long, mister. Be a dear and fix me a gin. <laughs> yeah, I'll be paying when I go get the dust on Ryan. Get the dang dog back. Shoot. Oh, where you at, El Diablo? There you're at. Alright, where are you at? Emerald Ranch. Alright, let's get it going. All right, hopefully after that, no, we get some good money back, okay? Because, you know, it ain't cheap. It ain't cheap at all. Time has been. You know how to go, basically go catch a cougar by hand and basically ride a zebra back? Well, I mean, by a, a mule back. You know, that's that hard work, you know? So he better be give some good stuff. I'm expecting at least 50 bucks from this, okay? So, yeah. Shouldn't have been too much of a problem, you know. Past line, you know. Now, with this, he got wrecked by a cat somehow. You know, dog getting wrecked by a cat. You hate to see it. So, you know, we'll just head up here, find another dog. I'm guessing, you know, it's probably done something it shouldn't have done. You know, maybe good to see for the, the cows, you know. It's probably lassoed up by somebody. We may have to buy a fight for the dog. Ah, that's what I'm guessing, okay? Ah, my bad, guys. My bad. You know, they, I'm trying to, to find a lion. Right on the line. Whatever. Yep. See you guys when we get there. Boys, get back! Get we dog got the first creature in here. Oh, yeah? It's as big as a mule and as mean as a hellcat. <laughs> it looks like a lion to me. That's a dog in there. A, a dog? Now, you excuse me. Oh, Christ! No cougar. Step aside. What? I said, step aside. Yeah, boy. Thank you, guys. All right. 
Didn't look like here, no boy. dog. Coming in. Come here, boy. Let's go. Alright, where is where's my dog at? You at? Look what you've done! What the Look what you've done! Oh, that ain't, that ain't no dog. Oh, that ain't no dog. Uh, I'll, I'll take care of this. Oh, God. What the frick is that? You're a lion? What the heck? We get a lion! Yeah, we'll get this shotgun now. We'll slug this thing. Hello? Jesus! Alright, uh, slow and steady. Yeah, uh, we're not taking this thing back alive, no. Nah. Nah, okay, we're blasting this thing as soon as we see it. Alright, where you at? Lion? You fang? Oh, shoot, I, I don't wanna get close. It said it's in here. Sweet. Oh god. Back there in that corner, maybe. Oh god, here we go. Shoot! Shit! Shoot! No! Oh, we're blasting. We're blasting. Calm down. Oh god. Oh god, god, god. Mark it, mark it, mark it, mark it, mark it, mark it. Blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it. Oh god, no! Oh, we got one tap! Oh, yeah, they more than escape. It wrecked us pretty good. Oh, uh, well, let's try that again. Uh, yeah, uh, we're going to have to have the quickest of things to go back in. Because, uh, I hope we're going to start kind of to the side a little bit, the legs. Okay, here we go again. Blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it, blast it. Come on, come on, go down, go down. Woo, we got it. Woo, he got it. He shot the thing. Jesus! I yeah, I'll take my trophy. Can I just have this whole thing? Oh, this cuts are. Oh, yeah, it's one of those trinkets. The lion's paw. Jeez. No, I, I'm, I'm sorry for what happened, okay, guys. Fella. You can keep that line at pace, I guess. Yeah, that'd be a great mantelpiece, honestly, though. You can tell your grandkids that. You see that? That's an authentic line. That attacked Emerald Ranch and some stranger shot it. Yeah. They weren't shot. I probably shot all the train. I feel like probably all like six to eight shots that I think did. Yeah, we're going back to Margaret here. Margaret has some explaining to do. You know, you have a zebra, a, a, a black bill that looks like a zebra. And then you have a. A lion as a dog, and then you have a tiger that's actually a cougar, or that, that one's kind of scary, you know, that was, wasn't expecting that. But then you say, you have a lion? That's not your lion? You didn't want to tell me that? After the other ones are fake? You know, I could, <laughs> you know, I could have died, oh wait, I, I did die, I got, got wrecked pretty quick, and my throat slit. And then the lion, quote unquote, escaped. Yeah, your boy ain't happy about that. No, I said fifty dollars. Oh, I want more. I want more than that. I want your head. <laughs> Jeez, I'm almost there. Hopefully, get done this mission. Here is explanation why, how, what, whatever actual line. He best be happy he has his zebra and tiger back. He ain't getting that line. He's gonna go back there and explain to those people where the frick that thing came from. I even get a line in the freaking Wild West over here and where at Texas, Montana, or freaking where at. Jeez. <laughs> Dang. Odysseus returns. Sally, get the cages ready. Yes, sir, Mr. Market, right away. A man eating lion. You didn't think that it might be useful for me to know that this time the animal was actually real, you moron? Steady on. I clearly stated that we were looking you for. You haven't clearly stated anything in all the time I've known you. That could have been a goose for all I <laughs> a knew. A goose? will hardly get them to their feet for the curtain call. Bring on the king of the beasts, on the other hand, and they feel the roar. And they, well, look about as surprised as you do. What have you done with him, if you don't mind me asking? I killed him. He's dead. Bloody hell! This is Rama, boy. Well, it was him or me. Now, pay me. 
Yes, of course, of course. Oh, I have out, just the thing. And what a treasure it is. You're a lucky man, sir. Very lucky man. From the mines of El Dorado, as green as the rainforest, as clear as the Amazon, and as dear as all the gold in the Andes, one man's labor is but a trifle compared to this jewel's true value. Wait! I shouldn't. What would Daddy say? Your Daddy ain't here, and we had a deal. Yes, of course. A promise is a promise. Sally, get the wagons moving. Ain't we waiting for the live? He's in the great hunting ground in the sky. Oh. Good day, sir, and thank you. But we really must be getting along. Yeah, I won't keep you. No, so long. So long, Mr. Morgan. Next time you see me, I'll be topping the bill, I promise. Or at least I'll be on the bill. All right, you know what? Left. That's gonna do it for today's video, and I hope you guys enjoy. You know, I was expecting the goddamn lion to be attacking us and wrecking us like that, but no, it didn't happen. So if you enjoyed this, please like this, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, because it's you support me and helps me make more videos for you to enjoy. Now, since it is in the video, you know what it's time for me to say. Hope the rest of the week is blessed, and I hope to see you again in the next video. And with that in mind, I'm out.